In this video, we will talk about the Manage Design toolbar at the top of your screen. The layout icon lets you show or hide the navigation pane, the details pane, and the preview pane. You can hide the navigation pane and you'll be able to see more designs. By selecting a specific folder and selecting a specific design, you can open the details pane and that will give you a lot of information about that particular design that you've selected. The preview pane will give you basic information about the design such as the width, height, number of stitches, number of colors, and the design grade. If you wish to hide that, just uncheck the preview pane. Keyboard Design Collection will open the Keyboard Design Collection Docker, and this is used to easily map any alphabet collections that you have on your computer. That will be covered in a later video. The Change View icon will choose how you are viewing the designs on the display screen. You can choose extra large icons, large icons, medium icons, and you will see the designs. A list will give you a list of the embroidery designs. Details will give you more detailed information and include information about the size of the design, the number of colors. Tiles will show you a small picture of the design as well as give you information about the file size, and contents will give you also a small thumbnail, give you information about the number of stitches and the size of the design as well as the number of colors. The group by category will let you choose the type of filter. You can have none selected, you can have the designs organized by folder, by file name, file type, or the date they were modified. You can also choose ascending or descending order. Sort files is used to sort the design by file name, date modified, date created, embroidery size, stitches, and colors. Again, you can sort in ascending or descending order. All these tools will affect what you're viewing in the embroidery library. In the Manage Design toolbar, you can filter the design by all machine files, all embroidery files, all artwork files, or specific types of formats. It's always important to notice what you have set in your showing box because that will affect what you see on your design screen. The search function will be covered in a later video.